Hello, everybody, and welcome to a, another episode of Becky Weekly. Uh, these past two weeks, I've been a little tired and sort of a little meh, <laughs> and I think that that's a, mostly caused by the time change, the fact that it's now getting dark so early and I'm just not really used to it, and I think that there's sentiments that lots of people share. I have tried to be doing some things that counter this sentiment, and that's what I'll be showing you now. Remember me and we played board games in a lovely board game cafe, which was also very fun. Yeah, I think I take the cards now. This week has also been very crafty, and I've started making a lot of things. Not all of them are finished, but they've started. I've just done a job that's been on my desk for a while, um, which is adding two extra buttons on my coat. So these are the ones that were there before. They're actually very loose, so I might need to add them again. And these are the ones that I have just added. So because of the way the coat is, how it is now is that this is actually comes out from me. So I have lots of space for me and my uh, my scarf. What a lovely, beautiful winter, well, autumn's day today. Uh, so I'm out in the park and I've come on a <laughs> hunt for pine needles because I found a video online how you can make a basket from pine needles and I was like, yes, that sounds like something I want to do. And I have found a tree with nice pine needles that are brown but still attached to the tree, which is perfect. So I'm going to pick them up. So hopefully it's going to be enough. I'm not sure. It was kind of cute while I was picking them. Uh, quite some people stopped and be like, "Ooh, what do you got there? What are you gonna do with this?" 
They're very cute. So the next step on the um, pine needle project is to sort them out a bit because I didn't do that while I was picking them. Um, to make sure I only have the nice ones and then um, I need to oops, put them in some boiling water in a pot and wait for at least 30 minutes. So the pine needles have now come out of the water and they are now bendy, as in they will bend and not snap, <laughs> which is good, um, which is what we're supposed to do. Right now I'm just preparing the thread the string that we need. So, so I've been on this project for about two hours now or something like that. Um, so I think I finally got the hang of what's sort of supposed to happen. Um, so I started off by doing things with one thread of string and that did not work. It kept breaking and yeah, falling to pieces in my hands. I think because the pine needles are a little wet and I think that that doesn't really react very well with, um, with string. Then I decided to, to do it with two at a time and that is working a lot better. So this is the progress that I have made. So this will be a project that we have to finish in a, another video. So there we have it, uh, step one of making a basket. So although it's getting dark outside and a little bit colder, there are still some things that you can enjoy about this um, winter season, such as the lights of the city and eventually Christmas lights, which are very nice in the dark, and autumn decorations, and lots of candles. So this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that you all had a good hello week. <laughs> um, and I hope that you find ways to make the change of seasons fun and bearable in whatever lockdown, confinement, quarantine situation you and your country are in at the same time. Thank you for watching to the end and I hope to see you next time. Goodbye!